What is up? Welcome back to another edition of Sacktown Movie Buffs. Once again, it's your boy Q the Critic, and I am back reviewing a new film that is currently playing in theaters. That film is Alien Rumbulus. Let's get into it. Um, so obviously the aliens is span for, you know, 40 some odd years. Um, and, uh, this particular film, um, if I'm not mistaken, takes place after the first alien film, but before the second aliens film. Um, so it's uh, about a group of, uh, young adults that are on this colony and they want to basically leave this colony and they find out there's like this deserted ship, um, that has like these pods. And so they basically travel to this deserted ship, um, or to like retrieve these pods so they can go to a different colony of their choosing or liking. However, of course, um, on this pod, there are definitely, uh, the, the aliens are definitely on there and things definitely, uh, take a, a turn, uh, quite drastically once they, uh, encounter the ship. Um, I'll sum it up by saying um, I enjoyed it. I thought it was a return to the fold from the first two Alien uh, films. As someone that didn't love all of them, I loved the first two. I uh, didn't care so much for three and four. And then I did, did like Prometheus and, and uh, Covenant a little bit more than some people did. Um, but this one was great. I thought it was fun. It was scary. It was suspenseful. Um, I did love that they kind of got away with all that mythology from the, the last couple of films that I saw and um, just kept it strictly like just horror. And uh, it's a great horror film. Uh, one of the better horror films I've seen this year, and uh, definitely check it out. It's a good-